time now for our Sunrise Smart Start. A serious crash closed down a Rochester intersection for more than an hour early this morning. It happened at the corner of North Winton Road and University Avenue. Two vehicles crashed there shortly before 3 o'clock. An SUV ended up on its roof with multiple people inside. They were taken away in an ambulance with what we're told are minor injuries. Police ticketed the driver for running a red light. They say alcohol was not a factor in the crash. The Rochester City School District is facing a serious budget discrepancy. School officials learned about it late Wednesday after a routine audit. For now, they believe the problem may stem from overspending to cover increased costs for special education and health insurance. We should learn more about this today. A lot of people scratching their heads about this one. Chocolate milk, it's a school lunch staple, right? But it could soon be a thing of the past. The New York City School District is considering banning the drink in what they say is an effort to combat obesity. A lot of other people say there are other ways to do that. Some upstate lawmakers are criticizing the proposal, saying the ban would be another blow to local dairy farmers. Young people across the world, including here at home, plan to join 16-year-old activist Greta Thunberg in a global climate strike today. The global strike comes ahead of the UN Climate Action Summit next week in New York City. It kicked off this morning in Australia. Similar demonstrations are planned today at the University of Rochester and RIT. All right, it's the last weekend of summer, and it is going to feel like summer, right, Josh? Yes, indeed. And going out in style, we are here across uh, all of western New York and the Finger Lakes from Hilltop to Lakeshore. This is going to be one of those top-notch, top-10 Chamber of Commerce kind of days. Get outside and savor the beauty of this Friday with temperatures that will be topping out into the upper 70s here in Rochester. Should be a little bit cooler by the water's edge of Lake Ontario with a nice little onshore breeze. Close to 80 in Dansville, and if you th think that's warm, wait until we get into the weekend. It gets even warmer. Beautiful sunrise here at the Port of Rochester, accentuated by just a few high clouds. That's all we'll see here throughout the day, and a nice uh, warm up after our cool start with temperatures again into the upper 70s, and a mixture of high clouds and sunshine doesn't get much better than this. So enjoy mm -hmm. summer's finale. Yeah, 80s on Saturday and Sunday. And Sunday. Looks good. Thank Love you it. so much. Thank you for watching News 8 at Sunrise. Our next update coming up in 25 minutes. CBS This Morning starts right now. Have a great Friday.